Welcome back to Let's Finally Get Around to Recording Some More Let's Play The Legendary Starfy. Now, last week gave me a good bit of strife, and I had to take my little break from recording. My apologies to everyone. However, that is past, and over the past couple days I've been unable to record because I've just upgraded to Windows 7. Which I say as I majestically wave my hand as though you could actually see me. So far I'm liking it a great deal, but it ha did set everything up so I was merely unable to record for a little while. However, I'm back now and with any luck I've got all the bugs out of the system. If anything goes wrong with this recording, my bad. I'm- it's still a work in progress. Regardless, let's get going! We're moving on to stage 5-1 of Glitzum Grotto. Take a dive! Now that I've rambled on for a full minute... Hey Mo, what's up? This is a Starfy and Starly stage, so Mo is merely going to invite Starly. And this level introduces a new mechanic. That is, these little buttons. You press on them, the water rises, and then you can swim. And the water slowly lowers when you're not riding on the button. Well, not riding on the button, but when you're not on the button. So you need to hurry and get to the other side, and you're a little jerk. You are. Now these barrels are something else. As you stand on them, they roll, and you fall, so you need to move quickly and jump often. And run, Starfy! More dude! More button! Water's up all the way. I do like how they have the nifty little 3D watery effect. So you can see in the background where the water is. Wee. And the sound is sounding a little staticky, which I'm not terribly happy with, but I'm st this is still a work in progress. I'm still getting used to getting all of this to function. With any luck, it won't be too bad. Hey, Mo, what's up? I have no idea what you just said. Sure, I can't. That's right, Shuriket was chasing off the other two members of the... Let's see here, what are their names? Snips, Ronk, and Papes. I'm concerned about Shuriket. Surely she could take both of them at the same time, but with your power halved when you use that technique. I don't know. I worry for Shuriket! We must quickly go and save her! Now we can go up to the right here, but there's really just a couple pearls, so we will head up to the left and get more pearls! And save while we're at it! And keep running just cuz. Oh hey, it's a room with these dudes in it! If you hit one on the head a couple, what is it, three times? I think it's three times. He gets angry and eats his friends! And if he eats all of them, he grows huge! So that you may smack him! Jerk! And you can skip all that and just go to the next area, but you get many a pearl if you kill him, and a sense of accomplishment, and I've fallen! Now this room introduces another nifty little mechanic as soon as I finish saving. Which is that you press this, the water goes up, and there's a current! So you have to fight the current as well! Crap! Crap! Get yeah, dang it. Darn you, current! No, Starfy, get on the button. This current makes it really hard to stay on the button! Okay, please tell me that's high enough. Please tell me that's high enough. No! I'm safe! I'm safe! I made it! Oh dang. And now as long as I don't have to do this anymore! Whee! Something tells me there's something to the left, but I know not where. Anything up here? We have a couple of pearls for us. 
More pearls, and I'm following a pattern. You are evil. Yes, I can still hear a little bit of static in the background sound. That makes me feel sad. I've said before, this is still a work in progress. And look how majestic that little fish is. Swimming by, dropping scales, which are probably worth a small fortune. Well, let's see, we have a save point, we have that, let's go through the door. And many currents that if Starfy touches will be stuck in a giant maze of movement. But as long as we have our little seal buddy, we can go wherever we please. Take that. Now this is a big area, and you'd think there'd be something hidden here, but there's not. You only have to find this door, it's the only thing in the entire mess. Now in this room, I am, do believe there is a chest somewhere, but I know not where. I've searched this room high and low, I couldn't find it, though I didn't exactly put all that much effort into it. Oh hey, platforms. What happens if I go up on you? Haha! -ha, maybe this is where it is. Just And for my troubles, I get a page from Shuriket's diary. Will this enlighten us as to the fate of our friend? Oh no, Shuriket seems to be in trouble. We have to hurry! We have to save our friend! We're almost at the end of the stage, though, you jerk. Take that! More water, Hemo. You had a burrito? I want a burrito. Yes, I am worried about Shurikit, though. Now, what else is here? This is an empty room. Onwards, then! Oh crap, this is a scrolling room! Oh crap, oh crap, I don't like scrolling! I don't like scrolling! Not at all! Oh crap, I gotta go up! Well, you can always assume the door will be, or the uh, passage you need to go through will not be where you are, and is that really it? Wee! 5-1 clear, and we got all of the secrets! I don't think there was a secret exit in that stage either. Because I do believe in 5-2, Rickety Ride will take us to that secret there just to the left. However, I will save that until next time! This was a small update granted, but I'm still working some of the bugs out in recording, so... Until next time, everyone.